Oh, I'm going to be talking about this game until it releases. Uh, so, <laughs> uh, the devs recently were talking about Gears of War 6 and its return to horror. Yes. Uh, I am one of those people that believes that while Aliens is a fantastic sequel to Alien, nothing will beat the 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 horror and the claust the the claustrophobia of the first film about these individuals dealing with something that is just completely fucking unknown. Um, one of the things that I really enjoyed about Gears of War one that kind of loses itself from two and three. Two and three leaned more into the action aspect. Whereas one was straight up horror was the krill. Let me tell you, like the krill were these were these uh bat things that they ate flesh, and if you stepped outside of a light source, they would just swarm you and just eat your ass up. That is terrifying. The very first time you run into a berserker in the uh, the mausoleum, and you can't you can't hurt it. And you can't run because if you run, it just comes running through the wall to just start beating you to death on the ground. So you have to like take it super slow and you maybe have to throw a grenade into like another area or another room so that it goes charging off into that area. Fucking terrifying. Uh, the very first time you meet uh, General Rom and he's just like infinitely bigger than any locust you've ever seen with that big ass knife. And and I think was it no it wasn't the Carmen brother that died was it just a regular it was either a Carmen brother that died or it was just a regular soldier who died and he picks he draws that long oh no it was it was uh Kim um Lieutenant Kim he was a part of your original squad the ball headed dude I always used to play as him in uh in multiplayer because he looked clean as fuck but where he gets Kim gets picked up and dangled. And Rom just takes the knife and runs it right through him, rips him in half and tosses his body to the side. And then you see the crow fly down and just start swarming around him as like this living body armor, living flesh. Terrifying. Bring back the horror. Uh, Gears of War E-Day definitely needs to have that return, which is one of the things I think the trailer definitely fucking nails. The trailer nails that, that, that vibe where you just went from fighting humans to now you're fighting these monsters that even though you're like seven foot raw muscle is throwing you around like a fucking rag doll is 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 picking you up and lobbing your ass with one arm across a whole fucking room that's moving furniture out the way as though it's nothing that's choking the life out of you and, and, and is on the verge of fucking killing you. And you have to, you have to think fast because if you look at the guns, the guns still have bayonets on them, which is something that came back in the later games. But the, the, the chainsaw on the end of the gun was designed to cut through the hide of a locust. So this early on, Bullets might not, certain bullets might not even be effective against the Locust Horde. How are you going to deal with a Berserker? How are you going to deal with a Brumac? How are you going to deal with, 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 with the smaller worms that are moving around? Uh, uh, how are you going to deal with like the Stalkers? How are you going to deal with people that are in the, the same cast as General Rom? Uh, how are you going to deal with the Locust, the Locust Elite that are wearing the, 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 the red heavy duty armor and they fire the, 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 the energy bows that when they stick you, they favorite weapon from the original game but it's the energy bows that when they fire it and they stick you it pings it's like beep, 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 boop, and then you blow up how do you deal with that bring bring all of it bring make it so that like there's a scene where marcus and somebody's pushing up and they don't see the locust elite guy up on up on the rafters and he fires the the bow and the bow sticks the dude and the dude turns to Marcus. You know what's going to happen, but Marcus doesn't know what's going to happen. It's like, beep, 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 boom, an explosion of just blood and guts landing all over, landing all over Marcus and Dom and just freaking them out. Like, what kind of fucking weapon is that? Like, this has to, this has to have the vibe, in my opinion, of Halo Combat Evolved, where you never encountered these alien weapons before, and it's Chief's it's not really Chief's first time, but it's our first time picking up like a plasma sword or a plasma pistol 
or or or, or a plasma rifle, anything along those lines, and using them and going, holy shit, this is this is effective as fuck. You need to have that moment where Marcus and Dom commandeer some of the locust weapons and start using it for themselves to get some people up out of the way. Like I said, every little bit of news that comes out about this game until this game drops, I'm 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 uh, we finna be here. <laughs> we're we're gonna be here and we're gonna be talking about it. So if you like it, subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.